it's noise, so you better, you better mind your P's and Q's. None of this barroom talk, you know. You know what they're like when they've had a drink. Exactly. Are you ready? <laughs> the coins are from the Bexley fundraising branch to hope everybody has a really good year oh, and obviously oh. the coins are for hope you have a prosperous new year. Oh, All the branch has, so that's what they're for. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> because how much did we raise? <laughs> Over 30,000. <laughs> So we've already got Amazing. 2,000 in the kitty from the thing. Yeah, as of the full th the 2nd of January, we had 2,000 as well in this. Uh, credited to us. Credited to us from an event that we did last February um, at a corporate event. So, so good. Really good. So, what are you aiming for next year? 31. Well, without you, without you <laughs> here, Richard, it won't be a patch on that. <laughs> Thank you very much. Have you got any lined up? Yeah, I've got um, Tesco's. Uh, coming Saturday, up. isn't it? Yeah. Are you going Saturday? Yeah. Oh, I can't do that, I'm afraid. Are you not? I don't know why. We're just grabbing. Have <laughs> you got a dog? Yeah. yeah. Talking of dog. What are we doing with this dog? Hello. I said, if you want. I, 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 know, I know the fact that. Hiya. Brenda was saying, oh, I'll come over to you. Yeah, the dog's on me. So long. Oh, oh, farewell. Because when I said about this, you always have a party. Yeah, I didn't have a party. Did I? Farewell. Even for your own sake. Yeah, I was saying, it's like slightly opening the thing like three dogs bouncing out. It's very big, Tesco. Is it? Hatch says it's very busy. Who is it? When you're coming out, you need to. Okay. Because she used to work there for dogs. Oh, we haven't been here for a long time. We've never been here. We've never been to this one. Yeah, it's quite well, quite well sorted out. Yeah, because we walked into the pub at the front, and then they said, oh, you're here for the party. Yeah. yeah. Got a look. It's around the back, so you've got to go out, out the pub and round the back. We made that Oh, it's a fork needed here. Nice fork. Have you got a nice fork here? Oh, and then added on to that, it says. <coughs> so, sorry, it says, sorry. Can you start that again? <laughs> <laughs> Seriously? Yeah. yeah. I want to hear it again. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. You need. Sorry. Ready? Ready? Action. Go. Go. <laughs> Dear Richard, we are sorry to be lo Dear Richard, we are sorry to be losing you, but wish you all the best in your new ventures. The dedication that you have shown in your role has been incredibly admirable, and we thank you so much for the time you have been put into helping guide dogs and helping the support of Bexley Fundraising Group. You will be sorely missed. And then I have added to that, that was from Jacqueline Juden, I would like to thank Richard for his unfailing and stalwart support at almost every event during this time as a puppy walker and his desire to do the best for the organisation and his passion to spread the guide dog story. Richard has been a very valued member of the Bexley Group and will be greatly missed by us all. We would like to wish Richard and Jill all the best for their new life in Norfolk and Bexley Group will never be the same. So um, nominated you for a pat on the back, Richard. So you should be getting the nomination through very shortly for that as well. Might I ask what one of those is? A pat on the back is a badge, and um, it's a letter you get, and you're, you're then uh, put forward for uh, the volunteer awards that come in June. Wow. Yeah. So, so if you do get to that stage, Richard, you need to come back down for the volunteer awards. I will. Oh, really? <laughs> it's going to be Doris, because she got one before. <laughs>
pass the parcel, this is. It's all very quiet. It is, isn't it? Come on, it's been the video. is killing us. <laughs> oh, thank you very much indeed. That's really kind of you all. Thank you. So, Richard will be very busy, but uh, um, Jill selecting their Yeah, Jill will be selecting them. Those parts will live on forever <laughs> for the best of memory. I'll save you that. <laughs> Jill wants a holly bush, so it'll be the Bexley holly bush. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Have you seen the plans of Richard's place? Yeah. It's like a, it's like a national park. <laughs> it's not that big. It wasn't Linda who had the problem. Well, Vespa had the problem. So when you're feeling sad and lonely, Richard, you can look back at those pictures and yes. think of us fondly. Oh, that's really kind of you. Thank you. I think you'll have plenty of uh, time to get his garden sorted out. Well, I think soon, I might. Yeah. <laughs> Plus all these people coming up to visit as well. I did that once, my dog was digging a hole and I, I wanted it in a certain place so I redirected him and he dug the hole <laughs> and I just had to do a little bit of it. Yeah, Idris has just discovered you. Yes, yes. Oh, well that would be perfect yeah. for the garden. Yeah, yeah. Unfortunately, yes. Oh. I think Brendan might be a couple of times. <laughs> <laughs> Don't put her off. <laughs> There's some happy memories here, I must admit. Oh, good old faithful collection dogs. <laughs> yeah. Have you, have you finished your renovations? Of all well, I had to stop while I was moving. I mean, yeah. I, I, I might um, <laughs> offer my services once I'm sorted out up there. Yeah. But. And if any of you want your house painted, Richard's the man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I've got, no, I haven't yet. I'm going to do it because I thought I'd give him um, Christmas out of the way. Because he was doing number 10 and 11, wasn't he? When he was yeah. yeah. He's, what, Downing Street? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I want a nice black front door. <laughs> That was at the Imperial War Museum. Yeah. They had the uh, poppy display. Okay, Miriam, you can start. Okay. Jack and Jill lived on the hill. Oh, no, sorry, that's the wrong story. <laughs> Richard and Jill lived on the hill with a fantastic view. The traffic jammed M25, the River Thames, and not forgetting the recycling centre. 
Although we've not known you long, it's been a privilege to set you right on puppy walking. Your, <laughs> your frequent re freelancing at the office hasn't gone unnoticed. In fact, I heard they had to change the times to keep you out. <laughs> your pups have been memorable. One wouldn't walk, one wouldn't eat, and Idris, well, he just does what he wants. <laughs> There you go, off on your talks, dogging toe, hoping for a check or money, but no. But you waffle on regardless, a story to be told. The bacon sandwich training won't be the same, but we will continue in your honour. You have both shown up, shown stamina in the tin rattling, being at Jane's beck and call, WhatsApps, emails and texting. Jill, through all this, has played along. Lucky that you don't know all her sign language. <laughs> Good job, only women have eyes in the back of their heads. <laughs> we will miss you both, especially Jill, to sort out our tech problems. Yeah. So, say, so saying goodbye doesn't mean that you're not our friends. Saying goodbye doesn't mean our relationship ends. Saving, saying goodbye doesn't mean it's forever. Saying goodbye simply means we will miss you both. So until we meet again, so long, farewell, cheerio, good speed, bon voyage, <laughs> adios, <laughs> aloha. Ava de Dirci, au revoir, a vida zain, tot vins, farewell, tara, oh sod it, goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> phone calls with Idris. No, so. no friends. <laughs> no, no. By the time you get to number three, you, you start to know what you're doing. Mm. <laughs> or just can't be bothered anymore. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Can't be bothered, yeah. It'll what, turn what out was, or it won't. What was It'll hardest? Right on the night. What was the most difficult, Richard? Number ones or number twos? <laughs> what are we talking about? Dogs or... <laughs> <laughs> was that William when he had the poorly poor? That was a very sad time, wasn't it? Oh yeah, George probably because I mean it's the first one and everything seems uh, so, so strange and uh, not knowing what you're meant to be doing. It does get easier the more you have. I must admit. <laughs> oh, it certainly does get a lot easier the more you do. <laughs> Hello, Paul. Oh, they're coming out. Hello, Pearl. Where are you? She's here. Hello, Pearl. 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 Oh, I've got to leave. I've got to leave, yeah. You didn't know you were putting, did you? I did. I did, yeah. Hello, Paul. It's going to be reversed, though, isn't it? We're still talking about here, but you will once we open the envelope. Let's get what we're on about. So I apologise that you're a bit isolated a minute, but you'll, you'll get the gag when, when people see it. But don't open the envelope. No, sir. Okay. Pass it down to it Jill. Jill can have one. Catherine. Can I have one? Yes. Thank you. Linda. Brenda. 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 Oh, tell me what's in it. No. Can't open Brenda. it. Okay. Now, for the whole. Brenda. Oh, Brenda's got one. No, you're fine there. You're fine. It's fine. Sorry, you can share. Okay. So, all year. Has Pat got one? Yeah, Pat's got one. All year, um, Richard has been playing with us with his. Wardrobe, <laughs> and nobody has ever seen it. Oh no, it's not, is it? <laughs> so, when I texted the other day for photos, oh, we no. now have the evidence. So you may open your envelopes. Oh no! Oh, it's not. <laughs> I bet it is. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, girl at the 
again, she's quite embarrassed. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, that's funny. That oh, that's funny. Will, we, will we see the man king if we come up to the Norfolk beaches? No, it's too cold up there. <laughs> I like the bit of hair I've got each side. <laughs> <laughs> and free PMP! <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> 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 I ran out of ink, I couldn't do any more pictures. <laughs> <laughs> so, Jill, if you want to put that as pride of place over your fireplace, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Luckily, you got one. <laughs> Miriam, you should have put it in a frame. Can I get you any teas or coffees or anything? Not for me. I'm going to go and find it. Good. 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 No, all I can say is just thank you to everybody involved. Uh, it's been great the last three years or whatever it's been. Uh, made some really good friends, really good friends. Obviously, I'm going to miss you all. Um, if you're ever up that way, um, don't pop in. Um, <laughs> no, by all, by all means, just let us know and pop in and see us if you're ever that way. Yeah, we need the caravan at the back of the garden so we just rent it out whenever. Oh, no. Yeah. Garden, no, 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 we're not in Essex, you know. <laughs> um, no, that's all I can say is just thank you for all your help. Everybody involved, you've all been helpful in your own little ways, and it's been a great deal of fun recommend it to anybody. So thank you thank you once again. Thank you. Thank well done. You.